Let's Burn with Brigands presents The Wheel of Death. Hello and welcome to Let's Burn with Brigands, the hottest gaming show on YouTube, and we're playing a crappy one today. It's Wayne's World for the NES. We're hoping that the context of Let's Burn with Brigands can make this game halfway entertaining. We have a basic built-in rule. Every time we lose a life, we're going to hit the next round. Let's spin the wheel of death. Even though we know. We know what the rule is. Lose a life. All right. Let's get that set up for the overlay. And we'll get into Wayne's world begrudgingly. This will be, no, be fun. Hang out. All right. Get the rule up on the board. We have it there. Lose a life. All right. Yeah, this game's really bad. I don't know if you're familiar with it or not. Uh, from its, I think, four-note soundtrack. Da -na -na. Da -na -na. No, that's three. I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, different levels have different musics. It's not like, uh, it's not like Friday the Thirteenth Limited, but I would take that over this game a hundred times out of a hundred. But let's play this. No way. Get ready to hear that a lot. No way! This theme's not that bad, actually. It's the, uh, alright, we don't need to see, like, a, a demo. This is the kind of music to play. This is like just getting together with a bunch of your friends that are coming over, you haven't seen them in a while. Let me bring you up to speed. My name is Wayne Campbell. <laughs> Excellent! Okay. I've got an excellent cable access show. Okay, I still with my parents, which I made is both bogus and sad. I've had plenty of Joe jobs, but nothing I'd call a career. Is this my Michael Myers, by the way? What I'd really love is to do Wayne's World for a living. It might happen. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's just like they took a few things that people knew about the movies and just uh, stopped right there. And they didn't even really build a game around them. There's that theme I was talking about. Oh, we can ride the drum, by the way. So Garth has a gun. Uh, let's ignore the fact that in the second way in this world, it's like, A gun? What? I, I never kill anyone. And that sexy lady wanted him to uh, kill her ex or whatever. <laughs> Come on, lover, you'll do it, won't you? Big sale, 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 big sale. Probably, yeah, when you, they're having a going out of business sale when all they have is the drumsticks and things that try to kill you. And they built like a warehouse that should be used for manufacturing or something as their guitar center. This is weird, I seem to be so small. Is this a dream? I look like a video game character. Excellent. Oh yeah, I told Garth's dad, B, that I would plug his store. The Wishing Well Convenience Store is uh, if what you want is not around the corner, it's just around the, uh, around the house. It's just around the corner. Top ten things Beef says. Hey, you kids, buy something or leave. Are you gonna buy that magazine? This isn't a library. Either you empty out your pockets or you are banned from the store. Shouldn't you kids be in school? Eat your junk food outside of the store. Are you gonna buy that magazine? Wait. Okay. Wayne is the coolest guy in the world. All the chicks dig Wayne big time. I wish I could be as cool as Wayne. Hi, my name's P. I'm a big dweeb. Garth is like, yeah! So Garth has the gun. Wayne has his kung fu kick, which kind of makes sense in the context of the movies. No way! Way! No way. That's what uh, my local guitar center just had a bunch of posters banners on the wall that said way and no way and then we got the ice skating the figure skating power up apparently <laughs> it's just the worst game no way way picks picks manager of the guitar center is like this is uh and then just oh, a giant record tower no, record tower trying to kill us here Da, 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 da. Just three notes. Just three notes. Alright. 
Anyway, I think we do get a, an appearance from Wayne's ex-girlfriend, his crazy ex-girlfriend that gives him the, uh, the gun rack on the next stage, actually. She's just kind of running around. Here's Ed O'Neill's donut shop, I guess. Puts them all on uh, different height shelves, just like in the movie. And you have to do just the right jump to get to the donuts. Lots of glass cases, obviously. It was originally a jewelry store. Ed O'Neill's a chill business owner. He just said, screw it. Kind of channeling some uh, Mitch Hedberg there, I think, when I say that. All the donuts. Excellent. I think we got an extra life for getting all the donuts. Hey, Wayne, let's go to Gasworks. Okay, Garth, who's playing tonight? Chai Green Giants and the Lousy Beatles. Are they any good? They suck. Then it's not just a clever name. Who else? Crucial Taunt, and they're just finishing their sets. We better hurry. Party on! They put no effort into this. The references to the movie are okay. The guy throwing bottles at us. And you think, like, oh, he's guarding something to the right. No, I've been over there. There's nothing over there. It's a dead end. Just immediately you go... It's like 10 seconds of platform. We're like, alright, new stage! Party on, Garth! Party on, Wayne! <laughs> I guess we'll... Can I have your gun? No way, Wayne! Is your kung fu moves. So many platforms. Glad they added this part out of the movie. Ow. Here's our crazy ex-girlfriend. she gonna give us the gun rack? A gun rack, Stacy? Yeah, right. I don't even own a gun. <laughs> Let alone many guns that would, necess that would ne necessitate having an entire rack. Are you mental? Get the net. We broke up. You just jump over her, where you can watch that. I would rather just have references to the movie than actually, uh... Alright. Actually play any more of this. A little breaks. Stage door leads to... Oh, okay. But another donut shop. Here we go. And there's, uh... What's her name? Very attractive Asian lady that he, uh... Falls for. Dream Weaver. Ah, gun. Yeah, this is the game that made you think, oh, I can make a video game when you were a kid. And then you were like, no, I feel like if I made a video game, it'd be better than this. I wouldn't make this game. So, if nothing else. Yes, every store in this game is like in a 10 times. Beeb is cool! 10 times larger space than it needs to be. Oh, ninjas! Can't have a Wayne's World game without ninjas and black cats. Oh, power up for a gun that, like, it's the spreader, essentially. Da, 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 da. Gonna scroll out a little bit of the screen at a time. This game actually does get kind of difficult on the last couple stages. This seems really easy right now, but it gets progressively harder. Cheaper might be the better word for it. Oh, a ninja and a black cat. Mixing it up, THQ. No need to go up on the boxes. I think there's like a special ninja coming up here in a second. Not yet. That's the move. Scroll a bit. Let the ninja come down. Beat you school. Not. Best graffiti I've seen in a game in a very long time. 
So yes, we will die in the back half of this game. I guess that was the boss, I don't know. That one's gonna keep Gary up at night trying to figure out the boss beater. So I guess if we get all these donuts in the allotted time, we get the uh, the extra life, so. Let's definitely bank some for the, the cheap portion of the game at the end. Special to go stands donuts. Ooh, and they made the O into a donut. Very clever, Ed O'Neill. Very clever indeed. Seven lives. <laughs> Schwing. Oh. There we go. Yeah, this is where it starts to get more difficult. Oh. Can't take that drop. My shins. I like the second one with the uh, Christopher Walken and all the graduate references and everything. I don't really know how it compares to the first one or what most people... Oh. No way! <laughs> and they give you an extra when it's the last life and it's game over. But for us... Knew this would happen at some point. Never had a no death run at this game. Then again, I haven't played it for a long time, so. Maybe quit your channel with <laughs> some Pitch meeting for this game. And then the TV images attack the character? Yeah! Oh. Did you cash that check we gave you at THQ? Or maybe they're the publishers, I don't know. Probably just more one guy made this game. It's all about the rhythm. That's what it is for those kicks. I guess we're in a television studio right now, obviously. It's the TVs that come alive and try to kill you, or the images that come out. Just little <laughs> chopped off plugs there. We just get close enough to this guy to kick him. You get too close and he just beats you in the head with the nightstick repeatedly. Spiders trying to kill you? Yep, you got it. Wouldn't be a Wayne's World game without spiders. Remember all the scenes with the spiders? It's in the uh, director's cut, I guess. Wayne! What are we going to do about all these spiders? I don't know, Garth. They're pretty bogus. Sounds more of a Bill and Ted lingo. It was stale by the early 90s. Another one of these guys. I think we can keep going right, but... I know the door is where we're meant to go in is here. Oh crap, can I get you to like go past, uh, can I get you to fall? There we go. <laughs> Some of the platforming's pretty rough. And then they make you go all the way back here. Yeah, this game sucks. with flavor. It certainly is light. Oh, it's that little kick there. It's just a little bit of... If it hits the wrong part of your... the right part of the wrong part of your mouth. That can be surprisingly, uh... Alright. Surprisingly bad. At least I'm an old pro at the, uh... Television screen. Of 
portion of this level. Is that water? Oof. I think two kicks will kill these spiders, but whatever. But whatever. Whatever that is, it hurts. I can tell you that much. Boom. There we go. Just have to have some momentum when I'm making these jumps. Oh. <laughs> Rock out while I'm carefully planning this jump. Yeah! Time well spent. Alright, made it through. Party on. That was one of the hardest parts. Final level is probably the worst. It's a tough little, tough gauntlet. There's wind involved, I'll say that. Gaiden 2 esque jumps. Alright, this might be the last level, but it's not easy. Okay. ABF. He just like drops the gun in like the bushes or something. No way, man. No way. So glad we have Garth for this game. Hey, Wayne, I think we're in the wrong apartment. You're right, Garth. I'll climb up to Benjamin's apartment from the balcony up to Benjamin's. Careful, Wayne. It's really windy out there. Condos! Yeah, we need to get up there. Oh, the cats are back, but I don't have my trusty gun. Because Garth wouldn't lend it to me. Can't let the cats gang up on you is the key. It's a lot harder to take on these cats without a gun. I think the garbage hurts. If it hits you. All right, this is the part that really sucks. Going back this way. Will you be my mailster? I need somewhere warm to, oh, what did I say? Don't let the cats pile up. <laughs> no way! A cat killed us. Where is this going to put us? Yeah, this game's not very good. Alright, a little medium buffalo sauce get us back on track. I kind of pause, all right. Most random assortment of enemies. Just, like they had a big book of just things. They had a big chart of things and they threw darts at it and whatever the darts landed on, those were the enemies they were gonna put in the game. Are you sure I can't get your gun, Garst? No way, Wayne. You know how I love my gun. 
fighting to fight these guys. It's too hard to line up the attacks with Wayne. Ah, oh, suck. Yeah, if you don't like nail that, that really sucks. Timing on the cats is very tricky. Ow! Yeah, you don't have the super jump like Wayne Campbell. Yeah, I don't know why I tried getting. There we go. Just ignore them. Watch out for the garbage. Alright, yeah, I think if I just ignore them, I'd be in better shape right now. They bring the ninjas back here? I don't remember. No, they have whoever this guy is. What? See, he might be the last boss, actually. No way! No, I think he seriously is, Wayne. And then we go all the way back here again, because why not? Hate the fall damage. Tears of the sun. Mimic the tears, I'm crying playing this game. Alright. Party on, Garth. <sighs> Who wanted to fight? Bill and Ted. Or Garth and Wayne. Took me a minute to finish that. And then, as an aside, he would uh, do better on a standard assessment test. Which pair? Alright. We're just going to skip. I would like to get one if possible. Nah, it's not a big deal. I don't want the special kick is the thing also. If I keep two on the screen... And it suck. I knew it when I made the jump too. <laughs> Wayne and Garth win both. They would probably win the standard assessment test thing. Yeah, they're not they're not that dumb. Bill and Ted are like close to dumb and dumber territory. Even though we love them. I didn't move that way. I really didn't. I wasn't pushing left. It was just like he jumped again. They're like, ah, it's fine. Kill him. Yeah, redoing the stretch over and over is a drag. I like the fat cat a lot more than those black cats that are trying to kill me. They really did Garth dirty with the uh, the levels. He doesn't really have much to do. He just fires his gun, rides a drum, jumps up a couple shelves, and his part of the game is over. I'm gonna make this jump on the first try this time. Yeah. How about that? Okay. Condos. I feel like the same marketing advertising company does everything here in Aurora. Where they're like, well, I mean, the secret to advertising is just putting up Really easy to to remember signs all over in stupid places. And just the same message over and over again. Because it gets stuck in your head, right? That's the secret of advertising. Alright, yeah, I think it's just, this is just the boss. And if I kill him, the game is over? Is 
So that's, we can all agree, that's basically a good thing. We're invincible right here. I don't know how. But I'm not moving. Oh, come back down. Don't be a dick. Just drop. That was working really well. Is he, like, moving backwards a little bit each time? No. Just drop down, man. <sighs> what a douche. Alright. Oh, hold on. What? <laughs> I can rock out while you're doing this. I see we have a timer. Alright. You gotta watch out for his knees. Yeah, I could do that jump, too. How many hits do you take? It's obscene. It's the worst game. If I run out of time... No one's invincible in this game. I'm sure it's not an issue of invincibility. go over this way. Maybe I just need to go over here. No. No way. Alright. I'm getting back there. I'm doing a save state. This game is just getting stupid. I think we can all agree I won right there. Awful and spicy. Now to about six and you might feel a little sick. That might be part of you. That wish that's burned with brains don't exist. And it's probably not the time. All right. Yeah, let's find out what's going on. <laughs> That's just it's obnoxious. Got your pizza. Stupid garbage. Uh oh. Twin cats. Two cats on the screen. No more are going to appear. There's a two cat limit, apparently. Come on now. Look how many of these cats just fall to their deaths. Alright, save state everyone, I'm doing it. I'm admitting to it.
What? I definitely did worse than that last time, by which I mean more damage to the guy. Excellent, but is it? Unless he was referring to the fact this game is over. That's right, that's the ending, by the way. That's the ending. You know what? This is the first time I've ever done this. Technically, we did beat the game, and yet, still. Loser! Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and comment on this video, and click subscribe if you haven't already, as this seriously helps me to keep making great content for you. And check the description of this video to see what song is playing right now.